received a nice package in the post yesterday from a friend of mine, Thomas Schoeffer, a German I meet at Nuremberg. I should be seeing him now, but with all the trade fairs cancelled, we won't meet. But he said to me the other day on our many conversations, had I heard of spiral socks? Spiral socks? Spiral? No, I sent me an email with a picture of it. Have you ever seen such a thing? When they're out of the drawer and hanging loose, they look like that with very clear spirals to them. And when they're worn, the spiral stretches a bit and it's not so obvious, but it's still there, but you're stretching around your, the, uh, the, the ankle and the bottom of the shins and the, and the feet as well. What's the purpose of this? Well, it was invented, he said, in the First World War, he thinks anyway, it was by German soldiers possibly worrying about their, their socks wearing out too quickly and heavy army boots. So how does it work? Well, I'll show you the sock first of all, which arrived just two days ago. There's a pair of them, which is his girlfriend, Anjo, very kindly made for me. And they've got a very obvious spiral to them, and they're quite long and quite big. I tried them on, they're very comfortable, and with cold weather, I shall simply have a go at using them. But I thought I'd keep them fresh, just to show you first before I start using them. So when you've got your foot in there, and you've got your foot upside down like that, you've got a, an ankle is there, and that's where the wear will occur. But hang on a sec, when I take this off and put it on next week, after I've washed it, I'm going to put it on a different way, just by random, not, not even trying to, just by random chance it'll be that way, or that way, or that way, always degree by degree, as you're turning it, the heel point, and also the stubby top of the toe will change position, so that it prolongs the life of the sock. What a brilliant idea. How much, how, longer, how much longer does it make it go? I don't know. I'll try it out. But a very, very clever bit of um, design work. That, and instead of the, the, the box he sent to me, I thought I'd have a go at a bit of fun too and do a bit of recycling. So he sent me a nice box. And all I've done now is I've turned it inside out and I'm about to put his name and address there on and send him some goods for my spare collection back again and for his girlfriend as a thank you for, for the gift. I love doing that. But I'll ask him to keep the box instantly so when he wants to send me something next year, all he's got to do is turn it around and send it back to me and then back and forward like that. Like a yo-yo going back and forward. So I think that's going to be a, a bit of fun. It did remind me though to look through my collection for other things. There was only one other thing I've definitely got, which I have shown before, but I'll show it briefly again, and that's the extraordinary Icelandic mitten, which doubles the life of the mitten by having a thumb at the top and a thumb at the bottom, and this one is tucked in so you don't, um, you don't actually use it, so I won't bother to tuck it in, but you get the idea. When I'm using the mitt, that's the surface which is wearing, that surface there when you're, in, the Icelandics are hard-working people, they're lifting rocks and pulling on ropes and so on, that wears down. So when it's getting a bit thin, they simply turn the glove round, tuck the thumb away, get the new thumb out, and now they've doubled the life of the mitten. So we've got extra ideas of extra life coming from socks and from mittens. Any ideas yourself? Can you think of some more clothing that you can prolong its life just by clever design. That's what I'm looking at. Instead, when I was thinking of taking it to the laundrette, or which, with a, with a little, what sort of um, temperature I need to do it at, I thought a laundrette reminded me of that extraordinary name for a laundromat, which I used in New York many, many years ago. And it, it was called That Missing Dock. When I did my laundretting two days ago, I actually left two pairs, well, four socks by mistake, but the chap knows me well and phoned me up to say, come and collect your socks, they're missing. <laughs> I hadn't noticed it, but never mind. But I love that idea of the spiral sock, which prolongs its life simply by the design. So get the old brain cells going.